Morning guys, Heather here from Willow Tree Missions. I'm going to talk to you this morning about our our shop and why it is so hot in here. And it's because we don't have an air conditioner. We have reached out to one company and they've quoted us $25,000 to run, I think, the ductwork and stuff like that. Um, that's been a few years um, once we got that that quote. It's like, okay, we, we definitely don't have that in the budget. Uh, we tried to raise funds and we have. We've raised over $1,000 so far um, for the air conditioner. Um, this morning it's already over 90 degrees in here. Um, you ask why we stay open. We, we stay open because there are victims in need and uh, we, we, we've got to reach them and we've got to help them. There are children fleeing with parents. There, there are victims that are desperate for an order of protection that need our help and our shop funds that program and why we volunteer. There's so many reasons why we volunteer. We have people come in that have retired and just want to give back to the community. We have volunteers that have been affected by domestic violence. We've had volunteers come that have been ordered through community service to be here, but then they've stayed. And we really feel like God has handpicked us to be here and to serve with this mission, to, to serve alongside God, reaching the hurting. Um, we have customers that have to come here and they, they need the bargains that they can get here. Um, there are very few places where you can get kids clothes for 50 cents and adult clothes for a dollar. We try to keep our prices low with a high turnover um, so we can help the community but also um, support our mission and um, we're, we're self-sufficient. That's not what this video is about. This video is just um, we need a hand up to get the air conditioner so we can stay open longer, so we can um, be here um, and be safer. Saturday it was over 100 degrees in the shop. We had our Christmas in June. Uh, a few of us were getting sick because of the heat, and so we ultimately at 2 o'clock we had to call it a day. Um, but I, I'm just reaching out to you guys if you can um, spare anything to donate to us. You can come into the shop and donate. You can send it to us. Our address is 351 West Monroe in Monticello, Illinois. Um, just make sure you put on there that it's for the air conditioner fund. We have another fundraiser where we're trying to pay off the mortgage of our shelter. And so um, donate to either, it's fine. Um, but just make sure you say which is which. Um, I'm also asking if there are any um, companies out there with heating and cooling that can donate um, to us or help us. If there are a couple companies that maybe can team up and work together to help us get the air conditioner that we need. Um, Anywho, I it is just blazing hot in here. There's not really good airflow. Um, so anything you can do to help us to to help the victims in our communities and it's not just Monticello it's all of Piatt County and um, we're just we're reaching everybody that we can and um, God will provide and we know that and so I have just felt led um, to make this video and make you guys aware um, of why it's so hot in here and why we still don't have an air conditioner because the cost is really steep and um, to be self-sufficient we have to make good decisions money-wise and unfortunately right now we just we don't have those kind of funds we raised a thousand dollars last summer which is setting aside for um, setting aside for the air conditioner um, but we've got a long way to go um, maybe not as long if there's a couple companies out there that want to help us get the air conditioner um, community members that that have extra that can give to us um, help us help the victims and the children and um, 
the employees that we have. We we want to create a safe environment, and it is just so hot. And um, but we got to do what we got to do. So if you were felt if you feel led to help us, we really appreciate it. Um, we will see you at the shop, um, hopefully in cooler circumstances. But um, we just hope that you all have a great day and and just to be blessed.